welcome to Lynn's Recipes. Today I'm making sausage cheese muffins. These are great for breakfast, for brunch, or you can use them as a complement to soup, or you can pop them in Ziploc bags, put them in the freezer individually, and pull them out and put them in the microwave for a quick breakfast. To make this dish, these are the ingredients that you'll need. You'll need a pound of breakfast sausage, whatever kind you prefer, half a cup of milk, can of cheddar cheese soup, two teaspoons of rubbed sage, three cups of a biscuit mix, and this is a biscuit and baking mix. This is Bisquick, Heart Smart, which I'm using. You'll also need a large bowl to mix and a muffin tin. This is actually a stone um, muffin pan that has been sprayed with cooking spray. I'm gonna start this recipe by taking the sausage over to my pan on the stove and browning it and then draining it. Okay, so now I'm gonna break the sausage up and start the browning process. This will take just a few minutes. Our sausage is all brown, so now what I'm going to do is pour it in a colander to drain any excess grease off of it. So here's my sausage that's been drained after it's been browned on the stove. And now we're going to continue on with the recipe. I have put um, three cups of baking mix in this mixing bowl. I'm going to add my half a cup of milk, my can of cheddar cheese soup, two teaspoons of sage, and my brown sausage. And now we're just going to stir all of this together. That's looking really well. So now we're going to put it in our muffin tins to bake. This will go in a 400 degree preheated oven for 20 minutes. And I use an ice cream scoop to fill my muffin tins. So here we go. It's usually about the perfect amount. So you can see what I'm doing. I finished putting my batter into my muffin pans, and I actually got 16 muffins, so I went to another pan uh, to use the rest of the batter. Now I'm going to put them in the oven for 20 minutes. Our sausage cheese muffins are out of the oven after 20 minutes of baking, and this is what they look like. And now I'm gonna put a few on a plate to show you. Hope you enjoy this recipe.